What's up, y'all? So, uh, it's a sad day today. My boy Dolph um, was... Rest in peace, Dolph, today, okay? Um, we about to react to this. Let's get into it. <laughs> What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And what the goddamn hell, yeah, league. So, appreciate the bitch, y'all. So, for one, I'm not going to be the happiest in this video. I don't have the best energy, not going to lie. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and put that out there. Um, but I want to speak and pay my respects um, towards Young Dolph. Young Dolph was one of my favorite rappers for show for show um he was just a dope dude all together you know what i'm saying he was a family man he loved his son i didn't know he was married um correct me if i'm wrong uh the headlines are saying he was married i don't know but beautiful family beautiful daughter beautiful son beautiful wife girlfriend respectfully whatever and um today his life was taken from him you know what i'm saying I have so many things, appreciate the bits, friend. I have so many things that I want to say about this. Um, you just never, you'll never say the right thing, you know? And that's why a lot of times I don't do these videos. Because you can never really say the right thing. Nothing you say is going to be right. So I want to just put this out as a disclaimer. I'm not doing this video for y'all. I'm not doing this video for a cloud i'm not doing this video for none of that i just genuinely am paying my respects to young dolphin just letting y'all know you know what he got me through because young dog got me through some shit okay <sighs> y'all pull up take a shot have a glass i'm drinking wine today liquor was not in the plans for today okay um it's sad, bro. Young Dolph made that fuck you music. You know what I'm saying? He made that fuck you music, okay? Literally. Like, fuck you, okay? Cut you off. I get a lot of my, uh, you know, my ways from Dolph. I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> he just, um, I felt like he was a smart man when it came to people. You know what I'm saying? And when I was down, he was one of the rappers I listened to for sure. He had uh, several situations of being shot at, bro. And and the thing is crazy because I think a couple years ago, he actually got shot several times. And oh my God, it was just everybody right now. Everybody right now. It's a terrible, terrible time. You know? Especially for somebody with a name, somebody that got some money, you know. He was at a, 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 a cookie spot in Memphis. And I don't know if he was, you know, going to get cookies for himself. I, I figured he was going to get cookies for, like, his kids and shit. So I was trying to figure out, like, damn, how these people know that he was at the fucking cookie spot. Like, how did they know? He was driving in the only army fatigue. Uh, I don't know what car it was. Probably a Porsche or... um, uh, uh, I don't know. One of them cars that cost a whole lot of money. Okay? A, a six-figure car that ain't got no business in this area. For his words, okay? He was in one of his wrapped army fatigue cars, which let everybody know where he was at. You know, a lot of people have discrepancies with freedom. It's not even a discrepancy. People think that they are freer than what they are. Now, some people like, yo, nigga, uh, I, I'm not going to go to the cookie spot. My, my sister can go get it, period. <laughs> um, 
come back, bring it to me. But then you got them niggas that I'll go get it. I'm going to go get it. I want to go, go get my own cookies. Bro, you a target. I don't care. I'm going to go get my own cookies. If I die today, it was my day to die. You know what I'm saying? That's how some niggas are. And from, from his music, you know, it sounded like he was one of them dudes. Like, nigga, I'm going to go get me a cookie. I don't care what you talking about. I'm going to go get it in my uh, Army Fatigue rap phantom, okay? Six figure card. I ain't got no business in this area. I'm going to go get it because that's what I want to do. Okay? He ain't thinking about what could happen because all these niggas in Memphis hate you. So it's a possibility that somebody could actually hurt you. He not thinking about none of that other shit except, but my nigga, I want to go drive my car and go get a cookie. Like, and I'm not being funny by saying that. He literally was at a cookie spot. Like, he wanted to go get a, a cookie, bro. Like, he also posted he was going there to support. He posted it? He posted that he was going to the cookie spot. Man, I... I would never understand. I don't know why why people have to post their whereabouts. I just, I don't know why you feel as though, you know, man, I got a lot of questions, bro. Oh, for his mama. He went to get it for his mama. Oh, child. He went there all the time. That's the problem. You have a, 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 a schedule damn near. That nigga be that, but it's a it's a hating ass nigga. Listen, y'all. It's always a hating ass nigga ready to take your life for what you got. Always. And people wonder why I act the way I act. <laughs> like I don't I don't I don't have to be them. People out here want you want your life if you broke. You hear me? You don't have to have a dollar. People want your life if you broke. People just want to be you. People just want to do what you can do. People just want to have what you have and don't even understand. You can't even walk up the street in these shoes, nigga. That's why I would have sent my assistant to do that shit. Because I understand that. That's why I don't care who I cut off. Cause I don't trust people anyway. That's why I don't give a fuck if I got friends. They your closest enemies. This is why I don't give a fuck when it comes to people. I don't. Because at the end of the day, you got to save you first. I got to save me first. And I'm okay with that. I'm so much happier by myself. Okay. Life hit real different in that light. And I swear if he just wanted to go to the cookie spot, bro, he didn't have to post that shit. And he definitely could have went in a Toyota Corolla. I'm just saying. Nobody had to know he was there. Closed down the spot. Had security outside. You are not regular, man. All these bots out here ready to kill everybody. Oh my God. Damn, they just killed Dolph, y'all. Y'all see his arm hanging out the window? No, friend, because somebody in front of it. Uh, actually, a lot of people are in front of it. Damn! Yeah, that boy right 
Folks be on some hating ass shit. They ain't getting no money. Y'all heard what she said? Realest shit in the world. Once again, you ain't even got to be getting money. There's so many people out here clouded up that's broke, that's waiting on their moment. <clears throat> people want their spot so bad. <laughs> Man. I don't see his arm hanging and I'm glad I don't but and I'm so glad his family wasn't with him they would have killed right here him on too. airways and catch him look he gonna try to block the roof garbage ass block the roof <laughs> <laughs> they need to block the view. Damn, why y'all want to see that? Y'all, am I tripping or what car is he in? A ain't he in the Army Fatigue car? Because if so, I don't see no arm. I don't know what y'all see. And I'm really not trying to see it, but I'm just saying. That looked like a window was up and everything. I don't, he in the camera car. Yeah, I don't see that. I don't see what y'all see. Window of the shop. Damn. <laughs> shot him in the damn store. Could have killed anybody in that store, man. <laughs> Right here on Airways and catch them. Look, he gonna try to block. Did anyone bother to try and help him? I'm thinking the same shit, but maybe he had just, you know, died. Instantly, I don't, I don't like know. Like the garbage ass. I'm glad he blocked the damn view. Blocked the roof. If they could, clearly somebody had to call because the police there, but I mean it ain't it ain't really much you could do if especially if you don't know what you're doing, you know what I'm saying? Like, Damn. They shot fifty rounds in a store. Uh, y'all, I'll never forget that nigga was in Charlotte. 
CIAA weekend. That's where the song 100 Shots came from. And then the whole song, he spoke about how niggas missed him and how the, how the niggas missed 100 Shots. He made a whole song off that. He actually had a bulletproof um, tour bus. So they missed. You know what I'm saying? So then he got shot last year, I believe. Or the year before that, got shot like five times or some shit but he survived and god damn man god <sighs> yo uh rest in peace you know what i'm saying young Dolph. this is this is terrible you know and um oh he got shot twice in 2017 okay Rest in peace, Young Dolph. <clears throat> I'm going to pull up for my guy. I loved his music and the influence that he had on the community, as he would say. And, um, you know, his family as well, man. Mm. I already cried. I'm not too quick to just come on here and cry, cry on this camera, but. Go ahead and end this video if I start crying. Uh, rest in peace, Dolph. This shit is fucking crazy, bro. Okay, I know his mama's sick. She gonna blame herself forever, man. She gonna blame herself forever. He probably just didn't want her to go to the store. Ugh. God damn. All right, y'all. I'm off this shit. <clears> Thank <throat> you.